want a cake pop? Here. What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is, it? is it a cake pop? A cake pops too? Right. On for you. Have brown ones. You have to get pink one. Okay. Cake pop. Cake pop. Try it. Take a bite. Yummy. Eat it, baby. Don't lick it. Bite it. <laughs> Take a bite. Yeah, bite it. Bite it. There you go. Yummy. It's cake. Welcome back guys. Welcome back to another vlog at that. I am in Lubbock right now. I'm sitting outside of the Starbucks. I just went through and got all the kids a cake pop. I got a coffee and yes, it is 90 degrees outside in Texas still, but the Christmas me wants to come out and it also happens to be my favorite coffee. It's a grande hot white chocolate mocha with peppermint. Peppermint coffee is my favorite coffee. So since we're in Lubbock, I was like, I have to get that. And then I also got a little breakfast sandwich for me too. But today is a full solo day for me. Isaiah had his first crane job start this weekend. So he'll be gone today and tomorrow doing that all day. And it is the first time I have been like solo with the three kids in a few months now since I started school and stuff and daycare and all that. So kind of a lot. And so I thought, why not get them out of the house and kind of contain them in a car? And we needed groceries really badly. So I decided to place an order with HEB here in Lubbock and pick it up. And so I have the cooler in the back with ice and everything ready to go for the cold stuff but I am here hecka early. I'm here like an hour early. So I'm just gonna sit in the Starbucks parking lot and eat and hang out with the kids. I'm about to put on some more cortisone cream because I don't know what it is, but mosquitoes love me. And so my feet, and specifically my feet, which is so bizarre to me, but they have eaten me alive. And so I've been carrying this around and lathering myself up in it like every hour. And it's getting really irritating. But my feet are starting to itch. So we're going to do this again. But we're just going to hang out. Let the kids eat their cake pops. And then maybe my... Because they said the substitutes and like out of stock stuff. They already told me what that was. So I'm pretty sure my order is like ready. So we'll see if I get a notification like any earlier that like, hey, it's ready, come get it. And I can just go across the street and pick up our groceries. Wide awake is the way that you left me. Sat beside in your car in the backseat. Wide awake is the way that you left me, oh. Now it's clear we are here back at your house. Keep fading into the background. I'm wide awake now. You keep missing out for sure. Okay, we just got back from the store and I thought I would do a little grocery haul for you guys. So, first, some go go squeezes. They had a Halloween version, so I thought that would be fun. Two of those, some like Nutrigrain bar type things, heavy cream for some recipes, some mac and cheese, some pasta for some recipes, tomato sauce. Some corn tortillas for dinners this week. Bananas, strawberries. The kids have all been coughing like crazy this week and I already ran through one of these so I picked up another one. Another makeup sponge, the Real Technique. The Real Techniques 
brand is my favorite, so I got another one of those. Danimals for the kids' lunches. My favorite spray cleaners for the kitchen. Tomatoes, bread, blueberry bagels, some burger buns, some chicken nuggets for the kids, and then the last thing was some wipes and diapers for Anna, Leah, and Noah because y'all are all out, aren't you? Hi. Are you all out? Yeah. No, Mano, what are you doing? He loves playing with those paper blinds. Absolutely loves it. But the kids are pretty much situated. They're just playing and watching the SpongeBob movie. But I need to put all of this away. I have dishes that need to be done. And then we'll just hang out. I'll probably start making dinner here soon too. Are you hungry? Mm -hmm. Okay, mom's gonna make some dinner, okay? Okay. I don't really need a new friend, so spend your time with me. Looking for someone who can play though, wanna hang with me. I'm not really looking for a friend, so spend your time with me. Looking for someone not afraid of. Give it all to me, get next to me, get next to me All that I want is to get next to you, get next to you Not asking for much, but it feels like the two of us are gold and the gold you see What do you got, so take a chance, take a chance on me It's magical when you are close, so get closer, babe What do you got, cause I am gold and I'm golden You're not really looking for a friend fed the kids dinner they, they just had chicken nuggets and strawberries and now they're watching shrek which you might be able to hear in the background well they're kind of watching it they're also running around the house like crazy i'm trying to get caught up on laundry so i have all of mine done that i need to hang up on hangers and get in the closet all of isaiah's is washing and drying right now what do you have you have a dinosaur <laughs> Rar. And all the kids are covered in like so many bug bites. I feel so bad, but like so am I. What do you have? Yeah. You have sunglasses? Yeah. 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 Sunglasses? Why don't y'all go why don't y'all go watch Shrek? Oh Shrek. Go watch it. But yeah, I need to get all of this hung up and put away and then work on Isaiah's here later too. But first, I need to do mine. Yeah, mom needs to put her laundry away. Yeah. Yeah. Drown yourself in the neon. You came to this place to hide away in the dark. You tell yourself you need to move on. But when night in the shadows can ease your broken heart
came to this place to hide away for a while But we both know that when it gets late One call away and then you are spending the night Let's turn the volume up, you shut your mind Wanna escape your thoughts for a little while But when you close your eyes, I'm by your side I'm by your side, right? the kids a bath and i've had several people mention this to me so i thought i would explain the bathtub we do have in this house is in the back room and it is very low to the ground and so since i'm pregnant pregnancy is so hard on me getting down on my hands and knees like that is just it would destroy me every time and i do this you know every other night so the bath or the sink being at you know counter height really helps and then on top of that I know there's some concern of like, you it's a sink, you know, what do you put in there? But I am very diligent about things. I do not ever put raw meat, raw egg, like nothing like that goes in my sink because it grosses me out. Like even if I wasn't bathing the kids in there, I'm not about to like stick raw chicken or steak in my sink. Like I don't let it thaw in my sink. I don't like any of that, especially also I kind of did it back in the day when I had a stainless steel sink, but now that we have this white one, I'm really afraid of it staining. So I don't like, I don't stick anything in here really, um, other than just, you know, dishes to wash. But I also give it a very good scrub down before I ever bathe the kids. So nice and clean and sanitized before they ever go in here. But honestly, when I'm not pregnant and we have the room situated, we will go back to bathing them in a bathtub. But for now, this is what works for us. So I'm about to do that. And then Isaiah should be headed home here soon as well. Who's going first? Uh, me. 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 Okay. Take her out. Mm -hmm.
juice in your gagas. Hey, get it. Come on, let's go to your room. Let's go. Yes, you can have a movie. All right, let's get in our beds. You're going to get a movie. Go get in bed. I sage? Okay, I sage. No, Lulu, you just picked. Go get in your bed, baby. Okay, put it right there. Thank you. Get in your bed. Get in your bed, Luma. Okay, get in your bed. No, we're not going to pull out toys. Okay, it's bedtime. How about one toy? How about no toys? Okay. How about that one? You want inside out? Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. Okay. No, I'll let you pick this one. No, we'll watch Ice Age tomorrow. Okay, I love you. Good night. Good night. Okay. There's a hug. There's a kiss. Isaac, hug. Okay, hug. Kiss. Good night. Okay, high five. High five. Boom. Okay, y'all go to bed. I love you. Okay. Good night. Guys, I just seared some chicken breast for Isaiah, and this is the best way. <laughs> To do chicken breast on one side I do white pepper cumin onion powder and salt and then I flip it and on that side I do black pepper and garlic powder and it is delicious so I just made him a couple pieces of those for dinner that's what he requested should be getting here in like five ten minutes so I am going to sit down edit this vlog that you're watching and then hit the hay because solo days with three kids all day long like it's you know 8 p.m so he's been gone like 15 hours since he left this morning at five so it has been a long day i'm sorry i didn't vlog like a ton of stuff but i've been kind of in like survival mode all day long and i have to do it again tomorrow so <laughs> I hope you guys still enjoy this vlog. If you did, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye guys.